Thanksgiving night, 2010. Jimmy had just purchased one of his ultimate dream cars. An 800 horsepower red Toyota Turbo MR2. Stephanie was all set to go Black Friday shopping with her friend. A friend who just so happened to be good friends with Jimmy. She asked Stephanie if she would mind making a pit stop before heading out shopping. Jimmy was up late that night working on his new car in a garage when his friend and Stephanie showed up. Jimmy popped out from underneath the car wearing an oversized baby blue sweatshirt and Corona pajama pants. <laughs> Steph first noticed the sparkly red car. Then she noticed Jimmy and thought, hmm, he's pretty cute. Jimmy was instantly attracted to Stephanie and her Mustang shirt and ripped jeans. After a bit of chit chat, it was time for the girls to leave. Being a gentleman, Jimmy walked them to the car. That's when he stopped dead in his tracks and asked Stephanie, is this your car? Yep, Stephanie replied. It's supercharged, right? Yep, and a stick. Jimmy was falling in love right then and there. This hot girl he just met is driving around in a supercharged stick shift Cobalt SS. You better rip it down the street when you leave, said Jimmy. And Stephanie did just that. Jimmy was left in a cloud of smoke as he picked his jaw up off the ground and went back in the garage. He could forget about working on his new car. All he could think about was Stephanie and how he wanted to see her again. A little bit of time passed before Stephanie found an opportunity to text Jimmy. She wanted to get her rims powder coated and asked Jimmy if he would mind going with her to price it out. She stopped by his house to pick him up and off they went. All Jimmy could think about was how attractive Stephanie was in this car just banging through the gears. And Stephanie asked if Jimmy wanted to grab a bite to eat. Heck yes, he thought. On the way, Stephanie had to stop for gas. Just as she was about to put the nozzle in the tank, Jimmy jumped out of a car and said, why are you putting regular gas in? Hang that nozzle back up and put in premium. After that, he jumped back in the car and locked Stephanie out of her own car. This was Jimmy's way of flirting and they both were having fun messing with each other. By January 5th, they were officially dating. They continued dating for the next seven and a half years. By September of 2017, Jimmy knew it was time to find Stephanie a ring. He wanted this ring to be perfect, so he saved every penny he could for nearly a year and went to Jared to buy Stephanie a ring she would absolutely love. It's now September 30th, 2018, Stephanie's birthday. Jimmy made plans to take Stephanie to Whiting Beach to watch the sunset. They arrived at the beach and walked out on the long pier that extended 100 feet into Lake Michigan. Jimmy asked if he could take a picture of Stephanie as she was looking out over the water. After a few moments, Jimmy asked Stephanie if she could turn around and take a couple pictures of him. But when she turned around, she found Jimmy down on one knee, ring in hand, and asked Stephanie, will you marry me? Tears instantly filled Stephanie's eyes as she gave Jimmy the biggest hug and said yes. Jimmy melted inside with happiness and they drove home holding hands the entire way.